to the nation's highest appointive post, Dean Atchison succeeds the retiring undersecretary. Of his responsibilities, Mr. At George Marshall. Budget director William Webb is named the man who held two of the most difficult punishing jobs the people have ever called upon an American to perform, retires. At his home in Pinehurst, North Carolina, with Mrs. Marshall, George Catlett Marshall says goodbye. For one reason, it was bound to be quite a long time before I would be in condition to resume my duties. And the state of affairs in the world today are too critical to have a long interval without a Secretary of State fully occupied with the job. As for my future plans, they don't go much further than Mrs. Marshall and myself returning to the house to sit down and rest up from this pleasant ordeal, which I might say is probably my final appearance in such uh, matters. <laughs>